Hello everybody and welcome to season two. As promised, today we're going to be starting with tutorials. So I am going to be teaching you today in how to set up Visual Studio Code, which is going to be the text editor that we are going to be using to code. Now remember to subscribe to my channel and always activate the ring bell to get notified every time that I upload a tutorial. I will be doing this from now on on daily basis. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing that you need to do is open your web browser. Now I want you to type in here Visual Studio Code, okay? And this is going to give you this website right here. So go ahead and click on the first link, which says Visual Studio Code. Okay, and you're going to download this for Windows. If you have a Mac, then you're going to download this on a Mac. I do have a Mac and I actually enjoy using more of my Mac. However, I am doing this for Windows because most uh, of you, when you get started, you're probably gonna get started with a Windows computer. If you're getting started with a Mac, then just install it in the usual way with a, a Mac SOS package, okay? So let's go ahead and do it with Windows first, okay. So when you go ahead and you click um, download, this is going to ask you the folder where you want to download the file. I typically select just my desktop because it's way easier. So I'm gonna save this here and this is gonna start downloading the file. Now, once the file is downloaded, you're going to click on it, you're going to run it, and you're going to accept, of course, the agreement. Then you're going to hit next. Uh, this is the location where your folder is going to, well, the program, I'm sorry, is going to be actually installed in. So just click next here. Then there you go. You're going to hit just next on that option. And then here it says like additional tasks that you would like to set up to perform while installing Visual Studio, like create a desktop icon and such. So, I mean, I do not need any of this because I can open all of this or, and I can actually uh, configure this later. So the only thing that I want to do is add to path, which requires a shell to restart. So just make sure to click on this one. Okay. And then just hit next and then hit install. And this is going to start installing the software in your computer. It's not going to take much time. Okay. So just be a little bit patient now. Once the installation is finished, you're going to be able to open your Visual Studio Code uh, program. So let's see here. Okay, it's done. So uh, it has this option clicked, which says launch Visual Studio Code. So I'm just going to hit finish and this is going to automatically open a Visual Studio Code uh, window here. Okay, and this is how Visual Studio Codes looks like once it's installed on your computer. Okay. So this is the first thing that you need to learn when you're starting web development, which is to install your text editor to get started. Now in our next episode, I am going to show you how to configure your first file. So stay tuned. Remember to subscribe to my channel and you can always take a look at the most frequent asked questions with the playlist that I recently put together for all of you. So that's it for today, everyone. I hope that you like this video. Also remember that you can always ask Lixie. Bye everyone. See you again in the next episode.